welcome back. This is going to be a very exciting video today. We're going to go through how to get products into your sexy new website. You might think it's hard, you might think it's complicated. I've got news for you. It's not. It's actually very, very simple. Ali Dropship makes this incredibly simple. First thing you need to do is make sure you are using Google Chrome as your browser. Absolutely a must for this process. Um, there is a Google Chrome extension that we'll be installing that makes importing products an absolute breeze. So without further ado, we'll get into it. I've logged into my WordPress dashboard as you can see. Come down here to Ali Dropship and click on that. Next thing we do is go to import products here on the left hand side. It's having a bit of a think and it rapidly pops up with this. To start searching and adding products to your store, please install Ali Dropship extension. So we're just going to follow through the instructions and do what it says. So we will install this. And click on the little Add to Chrome button. Simple as that. Add extension. Boom, boom, done. Ali Dropship has been added to Chrome. So we'll close that down. We'll close this down. We'll close down the Google Web Store. And now we'll go to aliexpress.com don't have an account there you'll need to create one simple simple process just go and log in boom we're done we have now logged in so we go to this um, look for products on AliExpress. So I'm going to look for anime notebook. Let's see what comes up. Actually, no, I will go to this Naruto one. 2016 New Creative Stationery. Da, 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 da. We'll click on that. That looks really good. Looks really good. Limited edition. 120 pages. Hard copy. Yep, that's great. Okay, you'll see here at the top, Ali Dropship. To start adding products to your store, please open another browser tab with the Ali Dropship plugin importing section. So we come back to our WordPress site and we need to click on this again, see if it reloads. There we go. Boom. Now, you see the difference? It's all um, changed the screen. We come back to AliExpress. The bar at the top here has changed as well. So we now have Ali Dropship Store. Your site will be here, whatever it's called. And it's as simple as clicking the import button. But before we do that, there are three things we need to make sure that the product and the supplier can do for us before we add this product. If we get this wrong, we can end up in a lot of trouble with um, complaints from our customers. So the first thing I want to do is have a look here and see that it's got some feedback. Uh, it's got 12 votes, 4.8, good feedback. People are happy with it. So that's a good thing. Next thing we want to know is that it's got free shipping to Australia, which is very important. We want that. And then also, if we click on this drop down, so we've got those options there, which is good. You can get a $2 coupon code if people want it. We sc hit, scroll down here and click on this shipping and payment. 
Okay. I generally want to see someone that is offering e-packet postage. Um, I very rarely do not make that a criteria. These guys don't. Having said that, the product is so damn good and the reviews are strong enough that I'm going to add this one anyway and then we'll go and look for another one that has e-packet. So we'll just click on the import button up here. See it's going through, doing its thing. It's having a bit of a think about it. This takes a little while. Pause this, come back when it's completed. Okay, we're back. That took about 45 seconds to import that product and we'll go and have a look at what that has imported for us. So we come back here to our WordPress site and we go to our import list. Okay, and here it is at the top of the page. So I'm going to edit, click on the edit to show you what's actually been imported and it's just amazing. Okay, so it, it always brings in a lot of stuff that's good and a lot of stuff that we don't want. This stuff at the top we'll get rid of and I'll show you that in the next video how to edit these effectively. And then we scroll down and you can see it's brought in the title, the description, the picture which is amazing. This will be a hot hot item. So very very cool. Lots of different options. It's brought all the photos in. That's brilliant. This will be very popular. Uh, the Ultra Turo, Turturo, Turturo, whatever you pronounce it. Also very, very hot. And then it's got their related products at the bottom, which we'll delete. All this stuff will delete. But you can see there, it's brought it all in. It's all there. Now we just have to go through and spend five minutes editing it. And uh, it will be amazing. Okay, so let's come back, we'll shut that down, we'll come back to AliExpress and we'll go back and we'll look at this one next to it and see if that has a packet. Again, 445 reviews, so we know it's a good product, averaging 4.8 stars, that's brilliant. Free shipping to Australia via standard shipping. That's good. We want that. This They may not have the e-packet on these because of uh, the size and the weight, I'm, I'm thinking. Having said that, I'm going to add this as well because it's just another really, really good product. I'll be, click on the import and be back in a moment. Okay, we're back again, about 45 seconds, and that'll have imported everything. Okay, back again, that's finished importing, the same as the last one, took about 45 seconds, so it was quite quick. I'm going to click on a couple of these tabs to filter some of the results. We only want four star and up reviews, so we'll click on that as well. Let it go through and do its thing. That's done. Uh, there's no thing else there we can do. So we'll scroll down and see what we can find as far as some notebooks. Here we go. Some little Korean creative small A6 notebooks. E packet. When you hold your mouse over it, oh, I'll just go back and show you that again. When you hold your mouse over it, or as you scroll past it, you see this green e-packet pop up. That's what we're looking for. So there's some stickers here as well with e-packet. This has got the e-packet, so we'll definitely click on this. Hasn't got any reviews though. That's a bugger. Um, I'm, I'm more nervous about lack of reviews than I am about the e-packet so 
We'll go back and we'll look for something else. Some stickers here that are e-packet. Let's have a look at those. They might be cool. So you can get two piece or six piece. Canine Patrol Dog Notebook. That's pretty cool. It's got some reviews. That's cool. Free shipping to Australia. And if we come down now and look at shipping and payment. So it does have e-packet, but they want $2.88 for that or a free shipping. So the difference with e-packet, it's just a lot quicker. It's trackable, things like that. $2.88 with our shipping costs that we'll set up later. I think we can wear that. I'm happy with that. That's a good looking product. Okay, I'm going to import it. And it'll take 45 seconds or so. I'll leave this one live. Boom. It's just about there. See the progress bar still going back and forth over here, back and forth. Won't take too long. And there you go. You can see in a matter of a couple of minutes, we've imported three good products that we can have confidence in the supplier due to the reviews. They've got the free shipping option. And this one has e-packet as an option as well. There you go. That's now finished. Importing, we come back to our import list here, and you'll see there's the three we've imported this more in this short little video in the matter of a couple of minutes. You'll find once you get into the swing of this, you can very, very quickly find and import 50 to 100 products, you know, very quickly, a couple of hours. And then you come back and in the next video, we will go through how to edit all those. I hope you found that useful and we'll talk again in the next video where we start editing our products to make them look super sexy and attract lots of buyers. All right, get stuck into that. Import your first hundred products and see you in the next video.